Hello, welcome to Witchwood. <laughs> My name is Mike B, aka Phony. This is for breakfast. Uh, Witchwood is a craft em up. A craft em up is a game where you collect things, kind of like a collect a thon, but you collect things in order to craft things in order to progress the story. At first glance, I thought it was a little, uh, I thought it was a little bit like Don't Starve. Got some pretty strong Don't Starve vibes from it. And then the more I played it, I was like, oh, okay, so it's more like kind of like a Cozy Grove. Cozy Grove was the game that we played uh, a few months ago. That was just kind of like a casual, like no no pressure uh, kind of title. You run around, you do little tasks for these ghosts and all that stuff. But it had a very Don't Starve feel in the uh, in, in the art the art style, the UI, all that stuff, right? It kind of had a feel. But there's no danger elements. Uh, and so with Witchwood, uh, it's kind of the same thing. There's some danger here. Uh, that I've that I've seen, and then that, you know, according to other reviews too, like it's not really a particularly dangerous game. You're not getting into combat or anything. It's particularly shallow. Um, mainly, you're here to run around and collect things. So, for example, I have a series of tools that I've collected in the in the uh, uh, the first uh, opening chapter, and I could use those tools to collect some of these resources. So I'm running around, collect all this stuff, and you guys watch me do this a million times, and don't don't starve. So this is nothing new. Uh, so I'm going around collecting things uh, in order to build and progress the story. I have tasks in the upper right in the upper right corner that I need to go and accomplish. I have this, this side mission that you come across, uh, and then there is this goat, and this goat says that I need to go and collect souls for him, um, because I'm a witch who's woken up from uh, a deep slumber for who knows how long, and apparently I made a deal with the goat. And it's, it's very heavily implied that this goat is the devil. <laughs> we don't know anything else yet. So the goat says, no, you made a deal. You have to follow through with it, blah, blah, blah. And I have basically nothing else to do because I guess I'm just a lonely witch in a hovel and uh, I don't remember anything. Um, and so I'm going to go ahead and do it. Now, the story is not necessarily the most striking, right? Uh, there is a sleeping damsel here that we need to wake. Uh, I can't imagine that that's the only, that's the end of the story here. This is probably just a footnote in the story. What, what game in 2021 has a, has a sleeping beauty? <laughs> as a damsel in distress. Uh, <laughs> but, you know, you're a witch with nothing else to do, so you might as well go ahead and help her out. Besides, before you had, before you developed amnesia, uh, the, the least overused trope in, uh, in video game history, uh, you, uh, you made a deal with this devil to, uh, to help, so. And in order to do that, you need to collect souls. So what do you do with all this stuff? Notice that there's more stuff here. I, I just came through and I collected all this stuff. There's more stuff here. You could, it's all, it's all reset once you instance. Um, and then again, collect more of this. So you do with all this stuff, you can hit Y and you come over here and you have some things you could craft. You could craft spells. Like here, it says empty jar, fi a fired earthenware pot. Okay, maybe not, maybe not exactly a spell, but uh, there are some, here goes some mending stuff. This is a speckle or a speckle or paste. Well, I have one, st I have one heart down because I got into a fight with the, uh, with a tree. <laughs> so we'll craft one of those. Let's see. A sprinkle of dust will reveal hidden mysteries. Ooh, let's go ahead and do that. Good. And then we have some traps. And then we see uh, sporific morsels. Yes, yeah, so this is sleeping magic. Oh, cool. We can make a sleeping, uh, another sleeping um, pill of sorts. Let me see. Can we craft another one? Nope. Okay, we need water in order to do that, which means, means we need jars. So let's go ahead and do this. Make a couple jars. After your first one, you could just basically tap it and you're good. It's so like, for example, we'll craft one, and then da, 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 you just tap the rest. Easy, easy, easy. Of course, kind of a kind of a waste. Is it a waste? Nah, it's not really a waste. All right, so now, uh, craft it. Oh, cool, craft some ending stuff. My bar is a complete mess down there. Um, hmm. Let me see. Can I <laughs> rearrange it a little bit? Let's put some tools. Let's see. Let's get rid of this. This is a. Uh, uh, that's your hearthstone, basically. Da, 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 da. And then a net and then a trap. Cool. That's fine. I should probably put this over here to the mending stuff. Actually, right, I need the mending stuff right now, so we'll do that. Perfect. What is this stuff again? Unveiling powder. Powder. I have no idea what that does. So let's go ahead and select this. And we heal for a one star, and let's go ahead and jump into the darkness. And this is where your quest hub is, or where your, uh, I guess, chapter hub is. So we're still in the first one here. I've already accomplished um, one one small task here, so there's um, now others that, that are available here. I mean, there are pretty large and uh, sprawling beautiful areas that link to other areas as well whoa that's the tree that's the one 
Um, I don't know what to do with him, but he, if I get close, he will stomp. Oh, 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 o
The game is beautiful, man. I feel like I'm playing a, a, like, a, like a kid's fantasy book, you know? It's crazy how well they've uh, designed this. I'm guessing that, yeah, I can't get close. Hmm. Probably use meat or something like that to draw them out. I bet. I bet these right here. Let's try it. Is he gonna go to sleep? He's got sleepy juice on. Oh, never mind. He just blows up. <laughs> awesome. All right, we come right to the chase, don't we? <laughs> All right, let's see. Cross the bridge. It says to the west, so we'll go check it out. There's a bunch of frogs over here. Oh, I'm gonna sneeze real quick off to the side. Is that was this Wilson in the ground right here? <laughs> it's like Wilson's. Statuesque corpse or something. Uh, I see. Oh, okay. Let me go and break these down. What do we got here? Toxic thistle. Awesome. Make some poison or something. Don't have to do with these uh, snails though. I'll have to go and check which which tool is gonna help with that. Okay. So this guy is big, a big bad, right? Big bad. What do I do with this guy? Uh, I bet I need like a hammer or something like that to smash through his shell. Crawl down. Oh, never mind. <laughs> I thought it was something stronger than a snail. There, one. All right, let me see. What's this guy's range look like? Rawr! He's gonna stop, 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 stop. But he's gonna forget about me. Okay, cool. All right, got it. Got it. So then, you want some meat? You want some meat? You want some meat? Yeah, you do. Oh okay, god. Okay, well here comes. Okay, that's that's where my meat's gonna go, I guess. What is this? A plot. Now is that guy gonna eat it? Does he eat it? No. Okay. You know, honestly, that would have been pretty rad if you did. Like, I, I would have been pretty impressed if it had a kind of a you know synergy between spawning uh, enemy enemy uh, byproduct and um, you know, have other enemies like eat it or something. Use it as a trap. Use it as bait. Let me see if I have something else I can use against this guy. See, sewing kit. No, <laughs> probably not gonna work. Uh, I do have one of. Oh wait, no, I don't. I need to make a thing. Yeah, I do. Okay, let's make one of those. Let's make as many of those as we can. Here we go, and then we'll make. Let's toss one of these and see if this helps. Oh, what the hell? Why did I do that? This way. Point. Good. Alright, he's not going for it. Yeah, he's definitely not going for it. Let's go get it back. Alright, we'll come back to you another time. <laughs> That's not a right now thing, apparently. Ooh, embalming salts. Yeah, I'm, I'm not going to go and... Chasing all those damn frogs. Let's continue on to the west. Now, there are other quest givers if you're worried about me spoiling it for you. As I was wandering around the world, I saw a number of other quest givers. So, this is definitely not a game where. Okay, hold on. Wicker man. Straw man arguments. Let's go. Hack, hack, no? Okay. Oh, that's a. Hmm. Hold on. There's something there. Now you're going to see the next part of the game here. Let me see. Can I hack this guy? Can I hack this guy? No. Can you, I don't know what I can do with him. There's a feather here, though. I'll take that. He's got range, though. Man, he's going far. Okay, we'll leave him out here. So mad. All right, so here's the other factor. The other uh, uh, feature, rather. Uh, if you hit X, you have this vision. And you can use this to see right here. It says, uh, Ra has given way here to something. Weakness is to interact. Okay, so just interact with it, huh? See, a thick moss growing on this massive fallen trunk seems to recoil at your touch, revealing strange etchings in the bark below. Slowly, a spark of swirling energy sweeps forth from the waterlogged wood until an ethereal doorway opens before you. Whoa! We found a secret door! Let's see what's inside. Oh, cool! We've unlocked another spawn point on the map. Excellent. Yeah, see, like I said, the, the uh, biomes, the map seem to be interlinked. I just didn't realize that you could also exit out that way. Nice. Nice. These things you just chop, get some wood, get some iguanas. The usual stuff when you when you break down a piece of wood. Okay, let's see. Clay, clay. Okay, here we go. Okay, there's a big, there's a big chonker right there. Okay. Can you talk? Do you talk? My character doesn't seem to know what to do here. Here we go. A fat troll sits squarely in the middle of the bridge, busy scratching on an itch on its back with a fallen tree. His unmatched girth blocks the path forward. Out of the way, you big galoots! 
He shifts his mask and releases a loud fart as you attempt to circumvent him. Woof! Fine, keep your bridge. I'll come back when, when the vapors have dissipated. Alright. Well, let's see then. Let's check the map. Are we going the right way at least? It says to the west. Oh, wait. Honestly, don't go. But what does it say? Uh, into the dark wood. Don't go in. There's absolutely no good come from being there. Oh, well, shit. Oh, I can't get past this bridge anyway, so never mind. This might be it right here. Ah, maybe we're here. Oh, sick house. Cool. See, little side mission. That's what we'll do. Get a, get a taste of this beautiful game. Hand drawn. Sick house. Yeah, let's do it. Uh oh. It's not looking good. Nurse, hold on now. This sick house is full to the brim and festering with disease. Don't you know there's a deadly plague going around? Plague, you say? This is the first I've heard of it. Oh, it's terrible. It affects the young and old and the healthy and the infirm alike. We're so small with patience, I can barely catch my breath. Man, this is too real. So what are you doing out here? Should you be inside tending to the ill? We've just got so many bodies piling up. Someone has to bury them before they spread the sickness further. She drops her voice to a whisper, looking ashamed. It's gotten so crowded, even uh, I've even had to dump some in the swamp. Oh man, that seems unethical. But don't worry, the leech is inside working her miracles on the other patients. They could, couldn't could be in better hands, the leech. The leech. <laughs> the <laughs> That's a talk. <laughs> I'm glad I'm not the only one. The best in the land. I don't dare think about how much worse it could be without her skills. I need to speak to her. I'm checking up on someone who, who came through here. Sorry, I cannot in good conscience allow a person of your um, years to enter such an infectious place without proper inoculation. Dang, I know my rights. No, I'm kidding. Uh, see, but with all the patience, we're low on medicine, and I'm afraid I don't have any to spare. Bah! What's a simple booster shot made for? <laughs> oh no! <laughs> I'll go do my own research. Get it myself. Well, it's a pretty basic prescription. If you bring me the components, I'll be able to mix and administer it. Then you go inside. Mm-hmm. Oh, bug your extract. Cool, we got some of that. Toxic thistle power, we got some of that too. Uh, lazy grass. Oh, okay, that one we may not have. Yeah, okay. We have to find some lazy grass. Yeah, they should just call this game Fetch Wood. <laughs> like, that's... It really is. It really is like a fetching game. But, you know, like Cozy Grove, like, you don't really need to have a... Um, I guess you don't really need to have like you know uh, disastrous encounters with enemies and and uh, harrowing experiences when the sun goes down. Uh, you don't necessarily need all that, I guess. Uh, you can just have a peaceful, you know, late night. I mean, the game's on the Switch, so you can have a late night adventure before you pass out. I do wish it would automatically switch to the different tools. That'd just make this a lot easier. A lot easier. So now we gotta find some lazy grass. Oh, watch out for that guy. What is this? Some kind of shrine, huh? Oh, yeah, it is. A place of power, but what end? Yeah, to what end? Huh, interesting. Yeah, and that's the other thing too, right? Like, the whole point is to explore and unlock and learn more about the land because you remember you have amnesia <laughs> yeah switching tools is kind of a pain in the butt but i guess they have to add some kind of game element here <laughs> besides just the storytelling you know this is basically a um a 2d uh uh walking simulator i guess and it's a, a semi-isometric walking simulator slash craft them up. There we go. There we go. That's what we're calling it. Okay, so hold on a sec. Let me see where I have to go. Let's see. Rod and aperture. Interest of the mercury. Okay. Yep. Yeah, okay. Uh, so, yeah, there's that. So, it's not going to tell me where to go, which is kind of a good thing. Let's go to... Valley. where can we go? This place is huge. Old town over there. This whole area, we've not gone over that way. Fresh air is beyond the woods. Huh. Can't go that way. Homeboy's not gonna move. I don't know where to get the lazy stuff. Guess we don't necessarily have to do that one right now. This guy. One well, winding up. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here, nerd. All right, we're just gonna take a shortcut to the next area. Hey, 
Here we go. Do, 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 do. Lots of this. Look at that. Cute birds. Oh, this guy. I mean, so he has a quest too, but I'm gonna skip him. All the all these characters kind of sitting around that you will see as we're exploring here. They all have missions just like that. Like this guy up here too has one. Some of them are small, quick, more designed to this guy as well. Designed to kind of familiarize yourself with the uh, with the different elements of gameplay. Others oh, are, you know, uh, like this one, the one we're on right now. Explore, looking for grass, looking for whatever. This looks like it might be it. Oh. What is that? I can't. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. Uh, unveiling powder. Let's uh, let's put that in our. I think we made some of this here. Now my vision will tell me that it needs unveiling power. Yeah, see. So that's the whole point of using the vision. Oh, pixie nest. Oh, okay. Hold on a second. Okay, cool. Uh, is that you're able to uh, basically <laughs> see. What what the weaknesses for different things are interacting and all that. So let's see. Where is it at? There we go. Gotcha, bitch. Fairy dust. Ooh, that's quite the trade. Hmm. Is that worth it? I guess the fairy dust can be used for something. I just don't have a whole lot of unveiling power. Let me see. Uh, oh, never mind. Cause I haven't made enough. Hell yeah! What the farm? What about the farm? These dudes. Where is it at? I see. I see you. I see you. Uh huh. I don't do this fairy dust yet, but we won't find out. Can I chop this tree down? That'd be rad. Damn. Okay, fine. We'll come back later and farm up some more. What do we got over here? Remember, we're looking for lazy dust. Oh, we got these guys here. These guys are hostile. Got their dicks. This thing, huh? A fairy shrine. Yeah, I don't know what to do with this. Let me, uh. Unknown. Oh, interesting. Uh, oh, dreadful doll. Hmm. It's cowardly at heart. How funny. Yeah, there's little shits, man. <laughs> oh, is this a dead end? No. No, it's a, there's a... Oh, I bet this probably clears up. There's a path here, but... Yeah, I bet it probably clears up later. They just didn't want to put a, another fat troll in the way. <laughs> Overused trope. Song of the Snake. A maiden weeps lakeside for her lost lover. Another quest that you can do later. I'm just exploring right now. Um, let's go down to what's down here. Can't bear the sweetness. Fleet work. Wow, there's so much stuff. Yeah, I don't know how long of a gameplay session or of a gameplay you can really get out of this, but in terms of like finishing the game and all that. But I mean, it, in terms of like, is it a relaxing experience? Yeah. Oh yeah. Like, 100% Cozy Grove vibes. What's this? Oh, more fairies? Sure, why not? Why not? Y'all don't respawn? Guess what? Oh, where'd he go? Little shit. I might as well use the last one here. This guy. Bam! Oh, where you at? They run. Gotcha. Can you do anything with the fairy dust? Oh, I can make a doll. Oh, wait, no, not yet. Okay, dreadful doll. I need sewing kit. I need some thing. And then some other things. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, I don't have any more of those. Oh, I don't. It's fine. Craft when I need them. I want to just see the other biomes. You guys can do the quests. I'm just going to explore and see if there's any more dangers to look out for. Another quest here. Sorry, bud. Sorry, can't help you. <laughs> can't help you, man. You know, spoilers. Ooh. Whole new, whole new area. Lots of things. Let me see. Uh, unusual hay bale. Labors of the Ox. It's the main story quest line, so I'm not going to do that. Bees. Ox's farm. Wow. So they had lots of little missions to do. That's good. I mean, that's what you'd expect. And they're all going to be, like, you know, fetch. Oh, look at this. Okay, hold up. What can I do with these turkeys? What's your weakness? Digestive tablets? But since I discovered that, now I can make them if I have... Oh, I need, like, I have Newt. What is that? Hold on a second. This is where the controller comes in handy. Oh, uh, yeah, it is. I have Newt. <laughs> Goblin snot? Oh, boy. <laughs> ah, lazy grass. You found our lazy grass. Excellent. But yes, whenever you discover something, you saw, you learned the recipe for it. Because part of... One of the, uh... Uh... 
story elements that you contend with is when you wake up, you don't have your spell book, so you don't know, uh, and you don't remember anything, so you don't remember any of your spells until you come across something where you, uh, where you're reminded of it, basically. Another quest giver here. Oh, he's, ah, he's fighting with the, <laughs> he's fighting with the fucking crows. Uh. Are you hostile, bro? No? What are you? A natural tinkerer. Huh. Suddenly refuses to read any instruction manuals. Yeah, I don't think we could hack him up or anything. You, you can live, frog. Oh, some chickens. Some chickens. Uh, interact. They're weak to interacting. Oh! Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these eggs, but... <laughs> the more things, the better. Lazy grass. We still need like what, like dolphin snot or some weird shit for the for this spell we're collecting for. The cow, what's up? We need a jar to collect some milk. Well, guess what I got? Guess what I got? Do I have a jar? I have a jar. Uh, guess what I got? That's right. A jar of milk, perfect for a wizard with indigestion. And absolutely nobody will get that reference. Absolutely no one will get that. Let me see. Uh, <laughs> collect moo, 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 moo. Boy! Just milking you right out. What is this? Giant hay bale. Oh, upon closer inspection, this mountain of hay appears to be deliberately woven into an intricate wickerwork structure. Oh, wait. I wonder if this is a, um... Oh, I wonder if this is a teleport. Yipping vortex. Aha! Cool. Well, I guess we might as well travel just to mark it on our map or something. I'm not sure. We've unlocked yet another one. Ooh, we have three so far. And we still have uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve or something, right? One, two, three, four. I don't know. We have something more. Wow, that's a lot. There's so many, so many areas here. I reckon you probably get about a good six to twelve hours out of this. You know, I'm just gonna go ahead and give you a super broad window, like a crazy broad window. That way, it could be right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here he goes. It's a happy dog. First time we get this egg. You happy dog? You happy boy? The tree. That's right. What do you like? Uh, shears and morsel. Oh, well, I don't necessarily want to sh shave the dog. Uh, although, although. We are here. We might as well collect because you can only collect one hair from a dog over any period of time. We could we could get all this stuff up, but I'm not gonna get it. What is it? It's uh, rich topsoil. Let's see how the amount. Oh wait, hold on a second. Is it the same topsoil we got from the other one? Clay, yeah, clay, exactly. Clay and frogs. Newts. Oh, those are newts. Wait, no, it's a grasshopper. Man. Oh. Oh, hopper leg though. I need that for one of my one of my. Uh... Oh boy, that's a big boy. Box. Okay, okay. I bet, I bet. He's probably someone you can talk to. Let me just walk up to him. Yep, he sure can. Probably has a quest for you to do. Where am I? <laughs> let's see. This is a relatively smaller a little area. Let's go to the next area. Let's see what we'll see what lies ahead. Dog's still sleeping. Oh good, take a good nap, boy. Oh, what the heck? This is where I just came from. It looks like that's actually... Oh, that's it. Okay, so this is a little quest hub over here. Noted. And then we could come over. We could teleport back if we want. What do we do with this milk? I can make... Uh, I can't make digestive tablets yet. <laughs> can't believe there's another exit over here. There's... Uh, ooh, some thieves or something? Okay, hold on. Let's see what their weakness is. Unknown. Oh, interesting. Let's see if we could uh, dodge our way through here. Oh, bandit cat! You peer through the hedgerow and see a ramshackle encampment. Oh, okay. Okay, I got nothing to gain from this nest of knaves. Better make myself scarce before they see me. You scamper back to the safety of the room. Oh, what the hell? Come on! Man, turkey's gonna start some shit. <laughs> Who's this guy? Friend? Okay, good. Oh, what the, what the, what the fucking snag vine. Yeah, see, there's so many things. Logger's hatchet, upgrade to my current hatchet. Oh, it's a bunch of fairies and stuff. Oh, we can catch some of these. Firefly. 
Yep, fairy dust. Dude, would you stop following me? Okay, wow. Nice, nice. I don't know what I need that for. What's this right here? Okay, I don't know what this guy's... Yeah, there's no... I can't chop him. There's a thing over there. I could go see what it is. But, nope, we're gonna keep on moving. Oh, got okay, another. That's the great pumpkin. Ooh, sunflower seeds? Or sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds. <laughs> <laughs> it's a sunflower seed plant, technically. So lazy grass. We got a bunch of lazy grass. Let me see. Hold on. Uh, I know I have to make a. Let me see. What was it? Um, uh, bug egg, your toxic thistles, and lazy grass. So I think it's. What am I missing? Oh, I don't have that one uh, selected. Hold on. Track this one. Uh, I have everything I need. Gather inoculation greetings for the nurse. Sweet! So then we make our way back. Well, I'm lost now. Um, okay, okay. Hold on. That goes up. All right. Hey, yeah, that's what we're going to do. We're going to finish this quest. We have so many resources just left over. And probably used for some other thing that we're going to learn how to craft. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Sorry, bud. Not in this lifetime. We're on a mission from God. Where am I? <laughs> Let me see. Is it over here? Lakeshore Path? Let me see. The decay? It's over here, I think. Yeah, let's see. Uh, into the swamp. Yeah, I believe it's up there. I think. If we could just try not to get distracted, we're good. Should have teleported. Oh, you know what? Cool. We could teleport. From here. Nice. Why did I say 12? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Wow. <laughs> I guess I really thought the circle was bigger. <laughs> okay. We make our way over. Yoink. And down. And over. Down. Down. Okay, over. <laughs> Just one of these. Excellent. Nurse, I'll need three milligrams. Yep, yep, yep. Guess what I got. Bam. You place a sloshing jar of ichor in the nurse's hands. She inspects it suspiciously, but doesn't ask where it came from. I'll need three milligrams of bug ichor. You no problem. You need that too. Snap off a few spiny thistles and pass it to the nurse. She's careful not to prick herself on the sharp ends. I'll need three. Yep, 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 yep. Lazy grass. Okay. The nurse nods at you, gathering all the ingredients into a small hand-sized mortar. You hold your breath as she smashes everything into a slimy, stinky liquid. Not the most pleasant stuff, but I can assure you it beats growing lumps where no lumps should be. Speak for yourself, one can never have enough lumps. The nurse shrugs at you, <laughs> sucking up the bubbly mixture into an oversized syringe. She gestures for you to hold out your arm. Oh my god. After stabbing into your flesh several times, she fails to find any veins at the point of the needle. <laughs> Sorry, you seem to have some strange physiology. Bah, give it here, I'll do it. You seize the injector and jab it into your arm with, without further fuss. A cool sensation climbs into your fingertips. You doubt the medicine will have any effect, but at least it should make the nurse happy. There, I feel much better. Can I go inside now? Oh yes, yes, of course. You should be immune to the plague for the time being. Just be quick, the leech is very busy. So now I could enter the sick house. Ooh, let's explore, but let's not talk because this is where our story ends. Well, hold on a second. Let's talk to this guy. Loud snores drown out all nearby. That's rad. Wow. 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 That's so cool. Yoink, 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 yoink. <laughs> Who's this? Patient just stares into the distance in silence. Oof, oof, oof. That's the leech. Erg. Got any more uh, loot hidden back here? There's something back here. Hold on a second. Let's see if I can. <laughs> Let's see if I can snatch some stuff. Oh, what does he got here? What is this? No. Oh, well, let me take it. Mm, okay. Okay. Why? I have plenty of room in my bag. Mm-hmm. And this is where our story ends. <laughs> like I said, it is a story-driven game, so I want to give you guys some of the exploration, some of the aesthetics, some of the ideas of how you know, questing works and all that, crafting. It's a craft them up right? So it's a game just designed where you just sit down, relax, laying in bed, playing your Switch, or playing your brand new Steam Deck. And just trying to relax, unwind a little bit after a long day. That's what Witchwood is all about. 
So you could check it out. It's available on Steam, also available on Switch for $19.99. There's an OST also available if you want some more chill. If you want if you need some more chill in your life. That's it. My name is Mike B aka Phony. Again, Witchwood 1999. Have a good one. I'll see you.